everyone, welcome to our next part of our California adventure. If you're new around here, my name is Brogan. I'm Benji. Hello. We are working in partnership with Attraction Tickets Direct, who are the most fantastic company if you're looking to book any of your attraction tickets all around the world. So we work with them for Florida, we went to Disney World, we've been to Universal, we've been to Science Park in the Tenerife, Tenerife yeah. which has been amazing, but they sell tickets for so many places. So I'll have them linked below. They have sent us out to California because we have spent the last five days in Disneyland. And if you haven't seen those vlogs already, I will link them below and you can go check those out. We're on day five, so we're having a transition day. We're checking out of our hotel and moving to LA today because we're gonna be heading over to Universal Studios. <laughs> we love Universal. We cannot wait to go to Universal Studios Hollywood. So really, really looking forward to that. The plan of today is, first of all, ignore our greasy, Brenji's not as greasy, I've got sun cream on and I accidentally burnt my forehead a few days ago, so we won't talk about that. Um, but yeah, we're satisfied with our time at Disneyland, we aren't we? We've so much. We've Done had a good time. everything we wanted to do. Mm -hmm. It's been great. Yeah. Full of snacks. And all the snacks. snacks. We're full of food. <laughs> so we're looking forward to heading over. So we're actually going to be staying in an Airbnb and the lady that um, we've been talking to said we can go around one, two-ish. So it's 12 o'clock now. So it's going to take about an hour to get there. So we're going to check out here and move to just outside of Universal Studios Hollywood. So we're going to be staying um, like across the road from there and then we'll be using Ubers and Lyft to get us around for the next few days. So come with us to Universal Studios Hollywood. Yo! Yay! We've just arrived at the Airbnb. It's just through there. Sat outside with the luggage because the cleaners are just finishing up, which is great. Benji's gone to get us a Starbucks because we are so hot. And the drive wasn't really good, actually. We fell asleep, so we both had a little nap. All right, so here's our Airbnb. Oh, it smells really nice. Ooh, wow, this is swanky. Very nice. I'll put the lights on in a minute, but little kitchen area down there, bathroom in there. Yeah, this will do us nicely. So we're doing our holiday hour away. We've just got an our Airbnb. I walked about 15 minutes up the road to go and get us the Starbies mm -hmm. because we were craving, weren't we? Yeah. Um, and now... I've got in my pyjamas and put my hair up. We've got Panda <laughs> Express delivered. And whoever was here before us left their um, American Netflix logged in and they've got the new season of How to Get Away with Murder. Which we've been dying to watch because we're obsessed. So you bet we're watching that today. Yeah, we've got TV on. We just thought we'd get little pots of orange chicken. So we're gonna do this, aren't we? Which is supposed to be like honey chicken from Animal Kingdom. I think so, but I don't think it'll be as nice, but... Good morning, it's Thursday, it's about 20 to 10. We have just been getting ready this morning. I washed, dried, and straightened my hair, which took a little while. And we are heading to Universal Studios Hollywood. We are about a five minute walk, 10 minute walk maybe? By the time we go through security and city walk. So we are gonna be spending today and tomorrow there. We have done some of the rides at the Orlando Universal Studios, but we have never been here before. And I know that there's some shows that I really would like to see today. And I want to get a butterbeer at the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. I want to ride the mummy, because that's my favorite ride. Oh, I love it so, so much. So we're just packing up our rucksack for the day. We're trying to be minimal, and we're only taking one bag between us. Um, so I've got our tickets. We also have express tickets today. Basically, express tickets makes you skip the queue. So yesterday, the wait times were uh, around 45 minutes to an hour for some of the big popular rides so this will be so beneficial for us so thank you very much for that we're gonna pack that in our bag I've got a lanyard around my neck um, and I have a clear little pouch and I carry our tickets like this because I find it the easiest way without having to like check my pockets for them so yeah I'm not gonna be carrying a rucksack today which is very bizarre um, Benji's gonna take it but um, we had an amazing night's sleep oh my goodness the bed is wonderful you know when you have like your type of bed and pillows that you like. It's very rare when I travel that I, I'm a bit fussy and it's rare that I find a bed that I like, but it's really nice. It's one of those like memory foam ones. It's great on my back, so that was lovely. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're gonna go, go have a day at Universal Studios Hollywood, which is so exciting. <laughs> Universal City, Cinema, City Walk, Universal Studios Hollywood. So this is City Walk, which we're gonna go explore later. Wow, look at those wings. Oh. This is so, so cool. 
I love it so much. There's so much to see and loads of restaurants and shops. We love it in City World, don't we? It's very cool, but we're just on our way to the front entrance. We've arrived! Oh my goodness, what a beautiful day. Love this. Let's get a photo. <laughs> Walk in the red carpet like a proper film star. Wow. This is so cool. Let's go through the store with the aircon. Love it. Look at all this merchandise. That's so cute. <laughs> is she fluffy? Oh, we definitely want a pin today. All right. So when you walk in the park, you'll see, this is all on the app as well, but you've got the upper lot and the lower lot, and then the live shows. We didn't have to wait at all through security and the ticket entrance, and that is because we got our tickets in advance from Attraction Tickets Direct, so you can print them out from home, bring them straight to the door, and it's really as simple as that. Obviously, like I said, we have Express Pass today, which you can get if you want, and they also offer a VIP experience. So if that's something you're interested in, I will leave the link below to Attraction Tickets Direct. It has everything that you need. Um, but we're gonna just mooch around, get some breakfast maybe? Oh, that's so cute. The theming and the detail around every corner is so cool. But we're gonna start with Spickle Me, Minnie and Mayhem. We love this ride, don't we? <laughs> yeah, one of our faves. Look at this! Super silly fun land. Oh, we have to go and do that. This is epic. Oh, so many Instagram spots. I think tomorrow I'm gonna to bring my swimming costume and just sit in there. What you saying? Yeah, Keen. Room without a roof, cause I'm happy. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> I like the bin. <laughs> Just round the corner, we've found a little viewing spot that people seem to be taking photos. So let's take a look. Look at that view. Isn't that amazing? So that's the studio tour down there that we're going to go and do later, and that will take us all round the back lots here. And we're going to see what each studio is filming in, which is so cool. Looking forward to that. Yeah, me too. What should we do next? Should we get a snack? Yeah. I think we need a snack now. We haven't had breakfast and I'm a bit peckish. How are you? Yeah, how are you? Look at that product placement. Isn't it great? Where are you from? UK. The UK, okay. <laughs> Stuart, keep the British, okay? <laughs> Can we get him knighted, possibly? <laughs> Do you have that pull? Just Did met you? a minion, Stuart. Stuart the minion. <laughs> now we're finished in silly, super silly fun land and we went on the silly swirly ride. And it was suitably silly. It was all silly, but in a fun way. <laughs> now we're going into France, apparently. Such beautiful theming and flowers. Wow, this is so lovely. Popping into the French Street Bistro. Oh, mega Rice Krispie cake, birthday cake. Oh. So we've stopped for a little snack. I've got a pot of apple and it comes with a little caramel sauce. <laughs> Which kind of defeats the point of having a healthy snack with a little bit of sauce, but it's yummy. And then Benji's got a croissant and 
we've got our refillable mug. $16 for the mug and we refill it every all day, every 10 minutes we can refill it up. Yeah. All day long. Um, it's cheaper wanna, than buying bottles. And if you want to bring it back the next day, then you just pay $9 a day and then use it yeah. We're going to head around this corner and go to our first show of the day, which is a special effects show. And it starts in 15 minutes, so we're going to head on over there now. Oh, the Wizarding World of Harry Potter! We're going to go there later. We're going to go there later. Top the drink up already? We'll have to try some of the new flavours. Yeah, because we don't have all these. We haven't tried all these flavours. Oh, look at it. Oh, my God. Okay. Some butter beer. Oh yeah, I can't wait for butter beer. I love it. But we're just gonna go around this corner and you'll see to the left here is the special effects show. So we're gonna go in here. That's one of the things I love about Universal is all the shows. Yeah, me too. We have Express Pass so we can go in here. This is where we're sat. Great seats. And it's all about how they create the special effects in the shows. This is my dream. I love all this. Oh, we missed it. You missed it. <laughs> They've got loads of facts coming up on the screens. I think that's my dream job. I'd love to like be a set designer. Yeah, that'd be Building fun. Sets. Yeah. So fun. I'd love to be the person with the headset, like, the yeah. <laughs> Directing <Boss> everyone. <laughs> yeah. From the very beginning, the basic concept of the filmmaking process has always remained the same. To make you, the audience, believe that everything that you see is real. So this mixed bottle that you see here, this is the actual bottle that was used in making the bathroom. Wow. And the attention to detail was hand painted onto a single sheet of glass that was lowered in front of the lens. Later, footage of the birds was incorporated to complete the effect. Kicked in the face? Like this. Oh! Is he okay? Yeah! the lower lot which is just down through there and we're gonna go and do the mummy and transformers I'm so excited all right so Universal Studios Hollywood is split on lower lot and upper lot this is a massive escalator to get down here I think we've just found the sign oh okay so world famous back lot down there King Kong the ride is that one in there Studios over there. That's where we're going tomorrow. One of our studio tour. No, Saturday, sorry, a couple of days. Walt Disney Studios is over there as well. Wow. How cool. Oh, can you? Yeah. Massive golf course in between all of it as well. This is where they make all the famous films. Like, just didn't it blow your mind that yeah. we're actually here? Just, I love it. It's so exciting. We've got more escalators to get us down. The second set of escalators. It is really far down, look, we're going all the way down there. All right, so this is Jurassic World, the ride, which is brand new, but it's not quite open yet. Look, they've got a dinosaur down there. They're doing technical runs as we're here, so we have seen a couple of boats just coming round. But yeah, that's where the entrance is. So we'll go down there and show you. Okay, so there's no queue right now. It's in technical rehearsal, which means we hopefully might be able to get on it today. It won't be the full experience because it's not officially open, but they've told us that if we keep an eye on the board, it will come up. Um, at the moment it says coming soon, so I hopefully we can get on it, but it, I mean, it's so exciting because it's brand new, but well, should we do Transformers or Mummy? Mummy? And you want to do Mummy, so we're gonna go and do that. 
Apparently, this one is much more intense than the other one that we're used to. So I have to put you away in a locker and I'll show you inside here actually, it's quite interesting. Uh, let's go over here. Free for two hours. Do you want to do the fingerprint and stuff? So you touch here. English, that's it. Captured. And then it will tell us which one. 833. Cool. Let me hold that for you. And then you and our phones and our, our, our sunglasses and everything has to go inside. <laughs> oh, I'm buzzing for this. This is such a good ride. The mummy was epic. And now we're gonna do this one. We love this, don't we? This one's amazing, like 10 out of 10. So good. I wonder if it's gonna be a different like, track to the uh, No idea. Look how cool this is. The theming when you're walking through the queues is so good. Thank you. Well, that was an exhilarating half an hour, wasn't it? One step. That was good, I like that. The Mummy and Transformers were epic. So, so good. They're probably two of our favorite rides. They are. They're next door to each other. Yeah. Bumblebees, me and people out the front. Do you think, are you hungry yet? Do you want to have some lunch? Yeah, I can eat. Where should we eat? Oh, there's Panic Express here. Do you want to, want to eat here? Seems like the most logical solution. Here's our lunch. We've got Chinese, so fried rice, chow mein, beef and chicken. Is it good? Mmm, yes. Theme park essentials, obviously. A refillable cup. A mini fan. I will leave this link below in case you want to get yourself one, but it's like having aircon in your face all day. A lip salve, because I seem to always get really sore lips. And I always carry a little emergency kit with wet wipes, tissues, paracetamol, hair bands for me, spare sun cream, um, all sorts of stuff in here, blasters. So this is the beauty kit. And uh, we also have snacks in the bag, in case you're in a queue and you want to snack on something. I always carry like, I've got like little toffees, like little things and mints. We also have these little pretzels we took from the plane. We have those. And and I also have my raincoat in here. And then we have another little bag which has all of our gadgets in. So spare batteries, we have our own reusable straws as well, um, memory cards, portable phone charger, that's a must here as well. That's what's in my park bag today. <laughs> we have a bottle of water as well, but obviously we bought the cup. Um, and Benji always has his own drink too, just in case we didn't get that. But that was a good lunch, wasn't it? I love it. Then she loves Pan Express. My, my new favorite new food. Your new favorite new food that we've had so far. Had <laughs> he loves it. You do like a good orange chicken and a bit of beef, don't you? But we're looking at a 120 minute wait for Harry Potter and the Forbidden Journey. We've got a few rides, but we're thinking of going to do this tram tour now as our bellies are quite full and that one is not a ride or a roller coaster. So, whoa, hear that? We are hoping we can get on it today, aren't we? We're gonna come back, we're gonna try again. Fingers crossed. Potluck, yeah, it really is. We have never done this before. And we're so excited. It's meant to be amazing. So, bring on Universal Studios Hollywood Studio Tour. Yes. Studio Hollywood World Famous Studio Tour. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> we got one person on the list that is super excited, and so am I. <laughs> Woo! Woo! Have you been on the tour before? No. First time. First time, yeah. It's gonna change your life. I don't want to oversell it. It's definitely going to be the greatest tour that you've ever had. We've come all the way from the UK to... No way. We're yeah. from the UK. Bournemouth. I used to live in London. Oh, we're about two hours from London. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Well, welcome to LA. Thank you. We and love welcome it. Welcome to Universal Studios Hollywood. <laughs> Am I going to make the YouTube video later? Probably. Great. See you later. <laughs> that was amazing. Hi. Hi. Hello. Thank you. Wow. It was an hour queue, but look at that. Straight on. A very special tour for you today. We're celebrating the 55th anniversary of the tour here. 
Uh, we also oh. were active filming lot, so lots going down, down, uh, lots going on down on the lot. If I ever have to turn down my volume, we do westerns, comedy, sci-fi. You name it. Universal Studios has produced it over the years. Now we were founded in 1914 by Carl Lovely, and Carl Lovely wanted Universal City to be the strangest little city in the world. 28 sound stages here on the Universal lot. A great example was on your left hand side. That is Sound Stage 12, home of the voice, hosted by Carson oh. Daly. Uh, you can see out here, this is another example of the base camp. You have the RVs for the stars and guest stars, hair and makeup tra trailers, all of, everything that's needed for the production sits right outside so it can be rushed in at a moment's notice. Just like that, we added some rain. Now, NBC Universal is a green company, so this water comes down to the bottom and recycles up to the tank at the top of the hill. Look out, car number three, take cover. Oh, it's headed our way. Look out, car number one and two. <laughs> That was Little Europe, the good place was actually filming on the other side, and that's why I had to stay quiet, because my voice carries a quarter of a mile, and then uh, Home and Family was filming off to our left-hand side. Whoa. Hang on tight, I'm sure David will get us out of here as soon as it's safe to do so. The Ladies of Desperate Housewives, that was Mysteria Lane, it was actually Colonial Street. So the Ladies of Desperate Housewives worked there for eight seasons on ABC. Oh no. Alright ladies and gentlemen, now our fire program. I'm sure the shark swam out to sea, probably. <laughs> Amity is now Kevin Cole. From Murder She Wrote, that's right. Don't stop, have your cameras out. But let's hear from the man himself. Here is Steven Spielberg and production designer Rick Carter on uh, how they thought of and executed. What did you think? So great. Really good, wasn't it? It was an hour long. It didn't feel like an hour though. There's so many things that you don't even realise that are filmed in studios or in like made up sets that and sets that they reuse for loads and loads of yeah, like Amity, films. Am, what was it Amity Co? Jaws and Murder She Wrote is the same place. Same place, place yeah. Amazing. So now we're gonna go and fill up our reasonable mug again and then head to the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. Guess he has a pee. <laughs> Time to enter Hogsmeade. Please respect the spell limits. <laughs> oh, I love it! and Harry Potter and the Forbidden Journey which is inside the Hogwarts Castle. The Forbidden Journey is awesome. It's so good. So we've been to the Wizarding World of Harry Potter, we've taken some fun photos, we've been to the rides, been through the shops, we had butterbeer, it was epic. Oh Shrek, Shrek. just chilling. Hold on. 
That's so fun. I love it. There's loads of characters out today. Um, but we are now going to head over to Waterworld, which is a show we've never seen before. Heard very good things. It's a stunt show. I think it's got jet skis and a plane and fire and all sorts. So we're going to head on over there because the next showing is in 15 minutes. So it's about the right time to get there about 15 minutes before. And I'm excited. <laughs> Wow, look at this set. This is so cool. All right, look at our view. Are you excited? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Your face. No. <laughs> Brother and sister. Do you remember when I blow dried my hair for an hour this morning? <laughs> Look at him. He's so happy. <laughs> spraying us with water. I'm a little bit wet, but I don't mind. In this heat, I don't mind. Look who it is! <laughs> this is amazing. Donkey is in this little booth here, look. From Shrek. That's so good. <laughs> It is hot, 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 but it's about quarter to five. We are tempted to go down to the lower lot again. There's been rumours. Rumours spreading around that the that the uh, ride might be running. So, should we try? We're going to try. All right, we've come to look in the shop. We do love a good gift shop, don't we, Benj? Love them. <laughs> oh, I would like a universal t-shirt. Look, there's some over here. Just in case we don't get on the ride today, this is what it will look like. You'll be on a boat and you will get wet, apparently. Um, and obviously you can get your photos at the end of the ride. We're just having a little look. Oh, what have you found? Oh, they're nice. So the ride is to my left. This is Jurassic. Outfitters, which is the shop. I just bought a pin in there, yeah. <laughs> then this is Jurassic World The Ride here, which obviously, as you know, is not quite open yet. And we're just gonna go and see Isla Nubar, see what's in there. This is so gorgeous around here, all the palm trees. This side is Jurassic Cafe, the taste of Costa Rica. And then swing around, and this is the bar. And we might pick up a, a little drinky. What's on the menu? I've got a pina colada. How amazing does my drink look? Oh my goodness, I love it. So I got a pina colada, Benji got a, what was it? Uh, Thai something, tiki Thai. <laughs> and how cool are the cups when we get to keep these? I love them. Is yours good? Oh yeah, you'll like that. Will I? How cool is this? He's massive. I just want you all to know that I did try on this spirit jersey and I was tempted. We've been down here an hour, we had a drink, we've been chilling, we mooched the shots, we bought a pin and the ride is still not open so we're gonna try 
for a third time lucky lake club. All right, we're now going into Krusty Land for the Simpsons The Ride. Oh, you're right. Oh, yeah, fairground rides. Oh, there's loads. There's loads of different ones. I want to win one. Ben, there's you. We just finished the Simpsons ride and I've done that one before so I didn't know what to expect but it was really good. I really enjoyed it. I'm trying to get it in the background. There you go. So it's five to seven. We have decided to go and get some dinner and we want to go to City Walk and see what options they have down there. So we are allowed back in the park with our tickets and and a stamp that they've done on our arm. So we're gonna go and have a little look. Do some shopping, get some snacks. Yeah, get some dinner and just mooch. We love City Walk. It's so quiet around here now. Look at that. Now's a good time to get a picture of the sign. I was thinking that is a good photo of the sign. This is one of Benji's favorites. <laughs> he loves Billabong. They're nice shorts, yeah. What is it with you and bucket hats? <laughs> it's a sun hat. It's not he actually likes that. Do you not like it? <laughs> I don't, babe. I'm sorry. I'm going to go and find a mirror. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> We've decided to eat dinner in Margaritaville. Can I add, after two laps? Oh, no, I don't fancy that. No, I don't fancy that. <laughs> there was too much choice at City Walk, <laughs> which is a good thing. But we decided on this one now. <laughs> Just thought I'd show you around this restaurant. It's really cool in here. Look at the theming everywhere. Five o'clock somewhere. We've ordered some drinks. And we're gonna have fish for dinner. You're having fish, I'm having shrimp and pasta. Cheers. <laughs> we had to get margaritas, didn't we, in Margaritaville. Is it good? That's tasty. That's tasty, tasty. How much fish have you got? That's mental. Look at that portion size. Oh my God, you can't even see your chips. Which I'm gonna nick one. Excuse me. Am I really your girlfriend if I don't nick your chips? And I've got mac and cheese. Shrimp mac and cheese, actually. Mmm. Oh, wow. City walk at night is fun, isn't it? Like Times Square. It's so bright and cool. I love it. We had a lovely dinner. We had a drink. Had Second one. drink of the day, actually. Margarita. Margarita in Margaritaville, obviously. Um, I had mac and cheese. It was so good. Shrimp mac and cheese. And you had fish and chips, didn't you? Ooh. It was good. Five pieces of fish as well. <laughs> you didn't finish it all. I left one. <laughs> he did good, to be fair. There's a show running until, I think, Oh, there's a singer here. <laughs> I think it's running until the 11th of August on the Hogwarts Castle in the Wizarding World of Harry Potter. So we're going to go and watch it. It starts in 40 minutes. So we're going to meet in the shops and then we'll go. <laughs> Did you see that guy get wet? <laughs> Oh, it smells so good in here. That is nice. Oh, it smells like heaven, actual heaven. Just been into Sephora because I needed some bobby pins, some like hair grips, and we've stopped into Abercrombie and Fitch and got the goods. The nice little tip is that it's really pretty at night. It's worth sticking around and doing it till late if it's open. So this is what we're gonna go see, Dark Arts at Hogwarts Castle, 9.30, 9.50. Yeah, exciting. We've seen that something similar, not the same show, 
at the Universal Studios in Orlando and they do such a good job in making the castle look so detailed and when the Patronus was in the sky that was such a surprise to me that was really cool so yeah definitely worth a watch and I'm glad we stuck around and don't yeah. try and force your way to the front we hang, we hang back you don't have to be at the very front to get a good view in fact the further back the better because you see more of it now we're gonna head back to our Airbnb we'll be back tomorrow so the vlog's not over just yet we have an animal show to see and we've not done Kung Fu Panda we did everything else so we're not doing the Walking Dead because I'm too scared um, <laughs> I'm a baby and was there anything else oh yeah we want to do mummy again Jurassic World hopefully we can get on a technical rehearsal tomorrow I don't even know if they opened it in the end but still that's that's what we're up to. We're just going to fill up our reusable mug to take back with us for tonight. I don't know if we're going to be able to get a photo, but I wanted to show you how cool this sign is lit up. It's nice, isn't it? Good morning. It's Friday. We're on day seven of nine days. We're here. Ten days. Nine, ten days. We are going to go to Universal Studios this morning and do the things that we said we wanted to do yesterday. Got my tickets. You print them out from Attraction Tickets Direct. Super easy. And then you go straight to the gate. Because we have uh, express passes, they print them off and I put them in my lanyard. So that is the system. Good morning, Benji. How's it, how's it? Are you okay? Yeah, another day in Universal Town. So once we're done with Universal today, we're gonna be starting a new vlog. Ooh, I'm on a busy road now. We're gonna be starting a new vlog to show you the things that we get up to in LA. So if you wanna stick around, then make sure you check out the next vlog whenever that's ready. Um, I am also going to be doing a Tips for Universal video for Attraction Tickets Direct. So I'll leave that video below when it's up and I filmed it. <laughs> oh my goodness, we've just walked in in Jurassic World. The ride is open! <laughs> okay, it's currently a 60 minute wait, but we're hoping our express passes might get us through a bit quicker. But either way, we're going on. Oh, let's hope, let's hope, let's hope. We're in. <laughs> so excited. No, I'm too hot. I'll just get wet. I know. This is the queue. We're back row though. Back row. That's promising. Okay. Wow. All right. Of the food chain sat the Mosasaurus, apex predator of the deep. You are clear for entry. Wow, look at that. It's a mix between like not VR or what would you call it like animated and like real life. It's yeah, those screens with the the, the um 
the dinosaur that swims that yeah. went underneath and he's cracking the glass. It's very good. Um, I think it's obvious to say we're going to do Mummy now. Yes. The Mummy is one of our favourite, favourite rides of all time in any kind of theme park. It is epic. Hi. Hi. Thank you. It's not our first rodeo, mate. We know the drill now. <laughs> all right. I'm still so impressed. Megatron. <laughs> It's so cool, isn't it? That he talks and moves. Okay, so in Lard Lad Donuts, they sell the massive pink donut, and I want to get one <laughs> because why not? So here's our donut. It is like the size. Well, it's like the size of my hand. I don't know. It's not like ginormous, but it is quite big to be fair. We are in Moe's Bar, and I'm not gonna lie, we did not struggle with the donuts, <laughs> did we? No. <laughs> Good. It was so good. It was everything I wanted it to be. I've always wanted to get one of these, and this is the day that we decided to get one at uh, 11 a.m. on a Friday. Because if you're not having a big donut for breakfast, you're not doing your holiday right. <laughs> um, but anyway, we're gonna go and do Kung Fu Panda next, aren't we? Has my hair gone curly yet? Oh no, it's not too bad. Still there. Still hanging in there. Um, Kung Fu Panda, and then we'll see what time we're at. Um, because we need to be at the animal show in 45 minutes. Get to go on and Bob, let's test your true love. All the hand needs to test your love level. <laughs> oh, really? Okay. Oh, watch this be cold fish now. Have a baba, I'll Have a baba. Have a baba. <laughs> How cool is Moe's though in here? I love it. All right, we're heading on out. We've eaten our donut. Sorry, you have to refer to me only as Hubba Bubba now. Hubba Bubba. Have you enjoyed Springfield? Yeah, it's been really good. I don't, I must admit, I don't love Simpsons. I never watched it growing up, really. I did, but I think because I've overly watched it, I'm not a huge mega fan. But actually, the theming here is no, really that's good. What I, was say. I really like it. Here. Yeah. It's really cool. It's really fun. Actually, There's I loads know, of photos. I know all the characters and that. You, everyone's seen the odd episode. Well, we were born 94, and for us, it was on TV on Channel 4, 6 p.m. every day, like after school. Oh, I remember no, watching no, it. No, that was that was when Neighbours was on. No, not Neighbours. Home and Away. Home and Away half five. No, it was always we watched no. Simpsons. Let's go do Kung Fu Panda Adventure, which we've never done before. No. Um, I don't think it, it's not at the other park, is it? So exclusive to here, so we'll see what it's like. Uh, oh my God, how amazing. He's, he's doing the tickets. <laughs> That's so cool. Oh, I didn't know this looked like this back here. Oh, I love it. This is cute. This is so cute. Also very appreciative of these fans. Look, look they're blended into the trees. Welcome to the DreamWorks Theater. It's showtime. Thunder and Rhino. Oh, I see your thunder and Rhino. It <laughs> brings you one talking donkey. Go down this way, please. Thank you. I just wanted to show you. It's good, doesn't it? There's a big theater. It's definitely, definitely designed for children, I'd say. You watched a screen, but it, the cool thing was it went all the way round, didn't it? And yeah. the screen was all the way down the sides. Yeah, so now we're gonna go and see the Animal Actors show that starts in 20 minutes. I'm sure this is quite obvious, but it's literally an animal show. Right, okay, here's our seats for today. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Stage <laughs> crew, let's clear the set, please. for over 40 years. Now most people don't know is that many of their favorite animal stars come from rescues and shelters. Up like a little landing pad. Sparky, she's been a good sport. Go ahead, take it back. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> well, next is up next, yeah, folks. Come on, lights, camera, action. <laughs> was absolutely 
absolutely brilliant. It had me laughing. Those animals were so cute. It was well worth the watch. Did you enjoy it? Yeah, I loved it. I loved really it. good. It was like half an hour long. Half yeah, an hour, I think it was. Yeah. Really good. The Scooby Doo gang are out here. Look. Oh, Marilyn. <laughs> That's normal. Before we leave, we're doing our last bits of shopping. We're going to go into the Universal Studios store and have a look at some pins and see what they've got in here. Okay, so we're wrapping up our time here at Universal Studios Hollywood. We are just going to go into City Walk and do a bit of shopping next though. We've had a great time, That's haven't really we? Fun, really really good. good. Lots of different shows and a few rides we haven't done and the highlight was definitely the studio tour. You have to do the studio tour. You can come Amazing. in. Amazing. Rides are great, but the studio tour is next level. Yeah, it was a really good couple of days out for us. So. And Waterworld as well. <gasps> yes. Waterworld. Waterworld was that, amazing. That was the thing I was most surprised about, like how good it was. It was a really good show. Really, really clever. So yeah, we're going to go down to City Walk now and have a little mooch. This shop is nice and cool. Here's my outfit for today. Gone for like casual dress from Zara. Oh, they have uh, Harry Potter pop sockets. That's cool. We're going back in the Dodgers shop because you want a hat, don't you? Yeah, possibly. Possibly. We're going in Hot Topic, which I've never shopped in and always wanted to, so I'm pretty excited about this. They have so much stuff in here. They have so many different franchises in here. This shop literally just has socks in it. <laughs> Love that. We're going to go in Nectar Bath Treats. <gasps> Look at these things. Oh, it smells insane. This is fun. I love it. So we've finished in City Walk now, haven't we? Yeah, it's been great. It's been really good. We've done a little bit of shopping, mooched around, and now we are leaving to head down to LA and spend the afternoon there in the next few days. So if you want to check out what we get up to, don't miss the next vlog. Um, and like I said, if you want to check out Traction Tickets Direct and the tickets that they offer for Universal, including the VIP experience and the express passes and everything that you need to know will be linked below. So thank you again, Attraction Tickets Direct, for sending us as well. We really appreciate it. We've had a great time and we'll see you very soon. See you later. Bye! <laughs> We love just charging